Okay, we're going to talk about a new Magisk module here. Not actually a new one, but a module which supports Android 12.1 also, but it was also supported for Android 12. A lot of users already found this module quite useful, and I think so. I made a video on this module on my Hindi channel, so I thought I shall share with you this module on my English channel too. I haven't installed that module right now. I will install right now ahead of you. But before that, keep this in mind. Make sure you have LS Post installed. How to install LS Post? As I mentioned, because I have LS post guide available make sure to check out that that might be quite helpful for you and as you can see I have LS post installed this is a UI and the thing is the best thing is today Android 13 beta, beta 1 was released and LS post supports that so yes if you're using Android 13 beta 1 you can try to LS post right now and I'm not sure if any module will work for the, of work or not but LS post will definitely so this is what we have installed now let me try to install that module so I'll take a look at that module and I'll show that how this module will work for you click on install from storage the file the model which we are talking about here is clear lineage uh, basically it will give you the blur animations everywhere blur kind of things everywhere and it will also change the switches from Android 12 to Android 11 looks quite good and looks quite impressive i've installed this module let me reboot my device i'll not skip any part in the video and i will also recommend you not to skip any part because if you skip any part if you miss anything you'll comment below to ask some queries it would be better if you watch the video if you watch this video till the end i've rebooted my device by the way if unless and uh, until it is just rebooting let me tell you one more thing as if you're having any kind of issues with ls post magisk expose any kind of modules you can watch out a lot of tutorial videos which are already available on my channel you can check out the videos all videos are already available and quite useful for you if you're still having any kind of queries you can message me on telegram i will try to reply you as soon as possible and i will try my best as i always mention so we are down we just rebooted our device right now let me show you by opening this as you can see this is how it is looking like the pin options or the pin menu basically you can see this is now this is having the blur um yes it was quite interesting actually i made a video that you can enable the blur with just a simple build prop line but yes this is also one of the modules which consists of one two more things which i will talk about let me just turn on my lock screen once if i move on and check out my quick settings panel this is how it is looking like full transparency everywhere it is not actually blur maybe sorry i was wrong it is not actually blur but it is a transparency module so as yes, you will see transparent effect everywhere which of course you can say it kind of a blur too but transparency is a correct word if i'm not wrong we have transparency in quick settings panel and you can see the power menu also has the transparency available and in recovery bootloader every menu has this kind of transparency available here and there other than else things are basically same if i try to check out the the section for internet section or bluetooth section etc it will not give you any kind of blur also if you're able to see this app drawer as i'm using a custom launcher called aospa which supports android 12.1 we have the blur or transparency available here and including that if you move on to other options for example switches if you're able to see the switches have been changed if you take a look at these switches for example in display you can see all these switches are now from android 11 and yes these switches you don't get in android 12 so yes this module will give you new switches it will change the switches it will give you transparency in lock screen it will give you transparency in quick settings panel and some bit more things here and there i think one of the best modules and you need to try it out it supports android 12.1 which i am using also right now this is a module which i was talking about called clear lineage link is already in the description and as i always said, say that uh, all credits goes to the developers i will try to give you the link and etc everything in the description these were things i just want to let you know i will see you in the next video and i will recommend you to subscribe the channel goodbye over the edge feel like i'm floating through the air